Hi everybody, we're on the road, well we're back on the road anyway, to McAllen, Texas. Made it, here's the crew, there's Bill, there's the rest of us, <laughs> and we're on a back road, oddly enough we just passed some zebras on the side of the road there, apparently a safari range. And I took a wrong turn back there in San Antonio, so we went too far to the east, and now we're to the west, and now we're headed back to the east. Uh, a little about a 50 mile detour. Anyway, we're headed back from McAllen. Any commentary, Steve? No, not really. Just <laughs> enjoying the ride. Alright. There's the actual church building there. Sanctuary, I suppose you would call it. It's actually quite nice on the inside. There's our quarters there. See, there's well, you know, the sign on the top. It. it says Ciudad de Refugio, City of Refuge. And around, that's the building across the street there will be the clinic and the, uh, well, and, and some other things. I'm not sure. You can see the walls freshly painted there from the youth group that was just here. There's another gate. And this, this field of green grass is you know, a big deal here. This compound was actually owned by a couple of brother, Korean brother drug dealers. And so there were, uh, the building used for the sanctuary was used for cockfights. And then that other building right over there had boxing rings. Boxing rings down there. And I imagine there was other kinds of gambling activities going on here. And then there is the residence. So that was the residence across the street with a, actually has a helipad on the top there. Hopefully someday we'll be using that to land here in the Hope Chopper. There's various ruins of unknown structures. Some piles of rubble here and there. Just don't really know what all this stuff was for at one time. That was some kind of radio shack. You can see the severed antenna there. Shot of our street here. All the things we take it so for granted. All that trash there. Just like paved streets. The mailman. I'm sure there's no mailman. Who knows if this street has a name? Yahoo Maps probably doesn't work here. The water, of course, is not drinkable when it's working. Sewer Ziffy. And all this just a few miles from our lovely United States. Over there, the distance there is the smoke from the garbage dump from them burning the trash last night. And amazingly, there you can see it. In the distance there, also a little mule-drawn, donkey-drawn cart. It's a horse running across the baseball field. All right, here we are in our first project, painting the wrought iron work of the clinic building across the street from where we're sleeping. It's incredible, actually, how tedious this is. I don't think anyone's yet completed one, one whole window. Numerous horses just kind of wandering around in the area. I think people are living over there in those cars. Here's the sanctuary. There's where we're sleeping in that building right there. There's my, there's my windows right there. Somebody's backyard. Look, they got him a boat. Sort of. There's a couple of guys working down there. Yeah. 
All right, here's our accommodations. Sort of the kitchen and everything room here. The ladies' dorm. Here's where I'm staying. Trying to get connected up to the wireless internet that we have even here. It's not bad at all, really. Gets cool at night and the fans do the job. Plenty of water. All right. Third take. Here we are at the prostitution center of Reynosa, oddly enough. Our van just overheated. And Judy, Alejandro's wife, and the ladies on the trip, the missionary ladies, are here to visit some of the ladies here. And we came along for the ride. Quite unique. Quite warm. Very warm. Very dirty. Kind of strange, too. It's a lot of little bars with uh, rooms adjacent. It is, isn't it? Hola. No, no. 